You guys hear those frogs? It's gonna get worse throughout the season, trust me, but with all the rain that we get, our pond's finally filled back up. It's frog heaven down there. But I gotta go get some feed for the goats and chickens. I gotta get this mop cut, and uh, I'm gonna talk to you guys about some issues that I'm having with these new goats, and maybe you guys can tell me how I can fix them or what to do about them. Oh, and if you haven't subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe button because uh, after our contest, as usual, a lot of people bounce. But uh, hope you guys stay, so hit that subscribe button. Well, we're back from the feed store. We're gonna go and unload some of this feed down to the chickens. We're gonna go see how they're doing. And then I'm gonna take a bell of hay up to the goats, bring them some of their feed, and we're gonna check on those baby goats because I'm having some issues with them integrating now. And I really don't know what to do because I've never seen this kind of behavior because uh, I've never owned goats before. Hey, did you guys order some food? We're gonna start storing the food down here. Since we're not hauling it inside anymore, we're gonna put a food barrel here so my son can just scoop and top off these feeders instead of hauling down these big 50 pound bags because it's a little windy, so I apologize. But back to what I was saying, um, he is about 12 and 40 pound bags are probably pushing his strength limit and he is a strong kid. And uh, we're gonna stick with the uh, keeping the feed close since we're dealing with 50 pound bags i'll handle them all he has to do is top off the feeders another reason why we're changing feed is because this stuff just looks a lot better you can actually see the corn and everything just pressed in this pellet it just looks overall non i don't know processes is that if that's the word i'm looking for it just seems there's more substance there. You can definitely see the chunks of corn. Our old feed, not like that. What's going on? Woo! Woo! I'm sorry. I forgot that you're a spaz. Oh boy. Boss man's gonna be mad now. Oh. Once again, windy out. It's springtime. You guys know how it goes. But nonetheless, let's go check out these goats. You know, the one thing that everybody's been waiting for is to get a good look at these baby goats. What's going on, Clyde? What's, what's going on, buddy? The goats are extremely friendly and we love it. The bad thing is, is these guys are making them skittish and I don't like it. And I think I might have to separate them. I know, right? They're just them big bullies. Except you, Boots. Boots is a... He's a docile one. He's not as aggressive as the other two. Mama G really stands her ground, though. Mama G really stands her ground. Patches. He's kind of an a-hole. But uh, Boots, he's more of the docile one. And I don't think he's causing a lot of issues. But they play nice when I'm around here, like not having any issues at all. I think it's food aggression. I'm not really sure, but we'll get into that in just, just one second. But let's look at the difference of these foods because I'm mixing two kinds of food right now for my goats. So if I can get an all in one shop, that'd be really good. This is an old food. This is what I mix up. Here's what I bought pre bag. Pretty similar in comparison. I can definitely tell you. I don't want to spill into this. Okay then. I could tell you, this is really wet, sticky. The stuff that I mix up, because I mix a, a sweet feed and a goat feed together. And this is not as sticky. So I'm going to squeeze them together. Yeah, you can kind of tell. Yeah. Either way, not really a comparison on uh, texture and look of the two feeds. I can tell you though, the stuff that I'm buying right now is made local and uh, 
I want to say it's a uh, St. Joseph, Missouri. The other brand is a box store brand from a it's like a tractor supply. We call it Bomb Guards. It's a it's local in the Midwest, and that stuff is made and stored in warehouses all over the place. So don't know what the age is on that, but I think this is better quality. Yep, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to thin this out a little bit. Get y'all a little little scoopy scoop. What's up, buddy? What's up, buddy? Keep an eye on him. Get you feel good, huh? It's like I said, it's like they're not getting food. But I know they're getting food because they got full bellies and I see them eating, but I also see these uh, three turds, Mama G patches, not so much boots messing with them all the time. Are goats dominant like that? These are my first goats, so I can't really say that I'm an expert on any of this, but you, you seem to be messing with them all the time. I catch you messing with them. And it's almost like they want attention. Yeah, seriously, it's almost like they're getting jealous of these new goats. Do goats get jealous? Are they getting jealous of you, sweetheart? Maybe? Mm. 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 She's a little pig, man. Listen to this. She's going to town, guys. Is that good stuff? Is that some good stuff? Listen, I don't know where you want this, but my last place, uh, the stuff didn't taste this good. What you doing, Mama G? I see that look in your eye. You guys are acting real suspicious. You guys aren't fooling nobody. Trim my hooves, hooves, boo. You see Is these things? They need a trim in. to have our hooves trimmed? Trim see, they basically get up out of the way. She goes and checks it out. And she'll eat out of it. Oh, and that one fainted. Come on, Bonnie, get up on your feet. You guys, this isn't for you. Go. Yep. They just got you freaked out, don't they? Don't they? Yeah, Clyde, you got it figured out, don't you, old son? He's like, you don't want to let me eat? I'll come eat your food, fool. There you go. He's like, I'm going to come back. I'm going to get some of this prairie grass. Mm-hmm, it's delicious. He says, I love me some of this prairie grass. It's so good. I just got to be sneaky in how I eat it. They go eat my food, I leave. Then I go eat their food. Yeah. Get some of that good stuff. Get some of that good stuff. Yeah, what you guys gonna do? You ain't so tough now, huh? Is that some good stuff, baby girl? Yeah, you eat up. You get that belly full. I'll stay here and watch. Make sure these meanies don't mess with you. Mm -hmm. 